Hey everybody, welcome back to the mailbag. Today we're talking about the 16 inch MacBook Pro fitting inside Shimoda backpacks. I'm gonna start this demonstration off with our Explore 30 and the dedicated rear panel laptop sleeve. So let's just open this up. Here's our laptop sleeve. It is padded and let's just slide this in here. Just a side note, this is the 2021 M1 model. You will notice the edges are pretty much flush uh, with the binding of the backpack's rear access and the corner of the MacBook Pro. Now when we're closing the door, don't just slam it down like this. Take the extra second and just make sure the corners are put in. And then close her up. That's about the amount of effort it takes. You know, the more you do this, the more you're gonna get used to it and uh, the easier it's gonna be. But as it is, it's already quite easy to do. Now there is one concern people have, and that is with the zipper and the corners uh, making contact. I don't know if you can see it on camera, but we do have this binding right here. And pretty much your laptop does not make contact with the actual zipper. Now the other way to do it, of course, just access it from the top. Open it up just like this, nice big opening. And then pull your laptop out. You wanna put it back in. Now keep in mind, I can't even see what's going on here, but it's that easy. I know there are some scenarios where people are shooting with their laptop in their bag. In those situations, you're just gonna have to accept a little compromise uh, when you're shooting like that. Now I'm just going by uh, comments I'm reading on the internet, but some people are absolutely not comfortable with using uh, the Explore series and the rear access. I'm not gonna argue either way. As a user and owner of all your gear, you are entitled uh, to your opinions and I totally understand if you wanna protect and keep your gear in absolute pristine condition. Uh, we are an adventure camera bag company. In my world at least, things do get a little dirty and scratched up sometimes. Of course, we do want to prevent that as much as possible. I am going to show you the front panel option and it's very simple. The front panel pocket is bigger and wider than the rear panel sleeve. It is also padded. So, very simple. Now you can also use the front panel pocket. Now if you really want some extra protection, by all means introduce another laptop sleeve for protection. And now I have a little more protection if I use the front panel sleeve. Now, personally, I prefer uh, laptop sleeves that have uh, the seams sewn like this. Bags and soft laptop cases tend to not have a lot of protection around the edges. And in my opinion, that's where your laptop uh, is probably gonna take the most impact. Uh, it's definitely nice to have this uh, harder edge to it. Now you may have noticed that I have to pull it out to access my laptop. So if I don't want to do that, I can use a top access sleeve like this one. Now admittedly, this one doesn't have a great deal of protection. Uh, honestly, where I live, I don't have a lot of access to uh, things like laptop sleeves for the 16 inch MacBook Pro. So this is my wife's and this one I bought specifically for this demonstration, but uh, you can just, Put it in like this and then uh, pull it out like that without having to remove uh, the actual sleeve. All right, so let's just show you how this is gonna look on the Action X30. Now, right off the bat, I wanna show you that the Action X30 front panel pocket is a little bit smaller than uh, the Explore 30. We're roughly at about uh, 43 to 44 cm. On the uh, Explore series, we are uh, well over 45 cm. So even though it's padded, definitely has a little more volume and will accommodate a little bigger laptop sleeve. In my opinion, you should probably shop for these in person, uh, not online, because you'll wanna actually fit the laptop sleeve in the bag before you buy it. So let's take the laptop and slide it inside here. Now you can see here that the Action X30 isn't padded on the exterior shell. So I would definitely advise using a case for the pack. And uh, there, that's how you have it in your Action X30. So hopefully this helps you get an idea 
of what it's gonna look like to have a 16 inch MacBook Pro in either an Explore 30 or uh, Action X30. Uh, note that the X50 and the Explore 35 both have bigger front panel pockets. So if you're after either of those bags, uh, you're gonna have a much more generous fit for your computer. The Action X series and Explore share the same rear panel laptop sleeve. Uh, the key difference is Action X does not have the top access zipper. So hopefully that helps give you a good clear visual on what it's gonna look like to have a 16 inch MacBook Pro inside your Shimoda camera bag. Take care and we will see you next time.